Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to another Ouya video. Today, why don't we look at this one, Dusk. Let's see what this is all about. Don't know how I missed this one while downloading. Oh, that's interesting. Almost like a, um, oh, dungeon crawler type game. Come on, play. There you go. If I would hit the right button, that would help. Hmm. Uh, Rigor Mortis, or Rigor and Mortis Production presents, press any button. Excuse me, drinking some whiskey there. All right, let's uh, play the game. Uh, log in, create account, updates. I have to log in. Okay, log in. Ah, that name's always taken. Anyways, uh, I'll be right back with you. Okay, okay, we're back. Hopefully, di I didn't include any of that. Anyways, so yeah, I had to do some... Uh, 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 registration there. So let's log in. Let's go ahead and create. All right, uh, you have 30 skill points to assign to your character. These are awfully loud in my ear. Let me turn things down a little bit here. Anyways, uh, these can be assigned to weight, strength, agility, and intelligence. Male characters get plus one strength and attack bonus for blunt hand-to-hand -hand combat. Females get one agility and attack. Sex this? No, i kidding. Uh, one strength, one none. Okay, whatever. So, I am male. Uh, weight 108. I wish... Actually, no, that'd be 100 pounds. So, okay. Uh, strength. I am super strong. Agility. How many points do I have left? I have six. Intelligence. Sure, let's just... Oops, uh, no. Oh, dang it. Okay. Actually, let's do random. That works for me. Okay. Uh... I am female. Well, that's what random said. So we're now a female. Create. Continue. Uh, dust score, redeem code, guide. Well, let's just play. Alright, so... There's our movement. We are one sexy brunette. All right, so can I actually move? Oh, I see. Welcome to dusk. You have arrived at Castle Brim. Eager to make your way in the world, there is much to learn. With hunger, creature, with hungry creatures wandering the wilderness, the castle seemed like the best place to begin. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, you can uh, game hits uh, tutorial settings. Okay. So. By the way, I'm using the D-pad. So this is the analog stick. And if I hit O, it moves in whatever direction I'm moving. So uh, press Y button to open and close the icon ring. Uh, walking next to many items will activate the icons. Look, okay. Uh, first thing you need to do, shop icon, basic weapon. Okay, once it's inventory, head down to the basement, okay. So let's head down to the shop. All right, so Y. And let's do some shopping. Talk. You bastard. I know you can see me. I'm right in the same line of sight as you. Uh, is this? Oh, there you go. Uh, cooked meat. Oh, that's the bank. Oh, I see. So that's what I have in my bank. Is this the buy? Locations, bank, post office, and auction house as they provide. Done. Why can't I buy anything? And why isn't he talking to me? Can I look? Look. Oh, I, oh wow, that's interesting. Look. I can look through walls apparently. And there's a lovely green grass over there. Okay. That'll come in handy later. What's this guy here? Uh, general, I'm a female. Level 1. Health, agility, activities. Okay. So yeah, this is a basic D&D &D dungeon crawler, isn't it? So how about 
dinner. Do the oh here we go. So now I'm here. You absorb mana into your hands b before casting a spell. Oh, I must. Okay, I see. Uh, that was you to access this menu. That's my inventory. So I have nothing in my inventory. Can I just go to the white walk icon? A walk icon is what I meant to say. This guy here. Oh, I can sprint now. You there. Again, does me no good, really. Can I talk? Anyways, let's actually go back to normal walking speed. Apparently, I can't talk to anyone. Nor can I talk to this merchant. Alright, anyways. How about you, then? Can I talk to you? There we go. That's weird. Why is it the merchant that has nothing on his shelves? The one I have to talk to. Anyways, buy items. Uh, talking foil. What was that? A uh, training foil. What do I have? I have a hundred gold. Uh, squire sword, bronze short sword, cloth sling, stone short bow, quiver, quiver even. Uh quarter staff so what do I want to get I can get a J uh, I can get that plus that plus that so let's buy that let's buy the gloves Let's buy the... Alright, and let's see about buying... What else do I need to buy? So I need an actual weapon. So let's stick with a sword. Let's get the... Uh, I have 66 gold. Uh, let's do this. I have 41. Let's get some kind of range weapon. Which is... Let's buy, buy all. Oh, I don't have enough gold. Well, buy what you can. I can buy 10, damn it. Alright, I'm done. Alright, talk. And you have nothing to say either. Alright, let's move on here. So, yeah, so you move this way. Hit Y to access the icons. And let's go downstairs. What's that? Oh, it's attack. How do I attack? Oh, uh, A. I have to be quick about it. It's actually attacking. Oh, shit. I didn't equip anything. Cancel. Run. Okay. Genius moment there. All right. So why? I need to equip stuff. There we go. Uh... I need you to where where wield uh, equip with your left am I left handed or right handed wield in your right done oh was that a creature I thought there was just something on the floor. Anyways, so... 
flash attack. Look at that, I killed something. Dang it, it's, ah, come on, attack. Slash attack. Okay, it's auto attacking. I missed the sewer rat. Cancel. Punch. There we go. All right, so. How can I pick anything up? Oh, there we go, it's the Y icon. Change. Thrush attack. All right, I'm completely confused. All right, uh, can't change. Kick. Just move. All right, hold on. I don't have any friends. Damn it. All right, let's pick up our stuff. Man, you have to be quick on this. You know what? I'm getting attacked. Get the hell out of here. Good thing I'm regening health. All right, hold on. Man, this is a bit complicated, isn't it? Punch until the thing's dead. Because apparently I think I threw my knife the first time I used I attacked with it. Come on! Kill the bastard! Work hard while I drink. Dang it, every time I'm pushing the wrong buttons. Alright, pick up all. Alright. Now let's equip the damn sword again. Wield. Wield in my left hand. Okay, now, before you die, actually kill something. A uh, thrust attack. There we go. Oh, wait, I'm using the wrong one, ain't I? Yeah. Flash attack. There we go. How strong are these damn beetles? I'm hitting it with a sword. There we go. All right, uh, attack. There we go, and remember my last attack at least. 
So it auto attacks now. Whenever I slick this one, it's going to keep doing the attack. Unless I tell it to change like there. Uh, thrust. By the way, what the hell is that skull looking thing on the ground? <laughs> I thought it was just like a rug or something initially. Alright. There we go. Alright. It was a bit rough at the beginning, but I think I'm getting the hang of this now. That's the thing about actual D&D. &D. It's very unforgiving. Damn it. I'm using the analog stick rather than the D-pad, so I'm losing a bit of accuracy there. There we go, finally. Okay, go there. Pick up all. Pick up all. Oh, I see. Done. Pick up all. Scavenge. Now pick up all. There we go. Again, something I gotta get used to there, I guess. Alright, so, because... So, in the, sca in the stink beetle, there's eight gold. Let me pick up the eight gold. Now let's scavenge the body. And let me pick up that. So, same thing here. Uh, so let's pick up. Actually, I could just pick up all, can I? Yeah, there we go. All right, let's go to the mushrooms. What's that icon do? You pick eight. Okay, I picked the... Hmm. So I am regening health, which is a good thing after that horrific incident there. Anyway, so let's move on. Because I don't have a key or anything to open these guys' cell yet, so. Alright, let's go down some more. Why well, doesn't this look cheery? All right. Come on, attack. Why aren't you attacking? Alright, you know what? If you're not going to attack, I'm just going to run. If you're just not going to play, why should I? What the hell are those things? Are those moles? Huh. Anyways. Can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread woman. Lucky shot. I think that just goes back to where we were. Oh, I see. So this is missing chunks. That's actually just not lit up. I supposed to be going or is this completely randomly generated okay so that's all a wall is this back the way I came it possibly is even though I don't remember there being a chipmunk here 
Oh, gold. All right, so what do I have? What loot? Holy cow. That That's pretty epic. All right, so let me... See what I got. Soft leather helmet. What else do I have then? What's this? Oh, soft handed wooden club. Do I have anything else I should? Oh well. So yeah, sweet, look at that. I got some nice loot. There's some more right here. Wonder if like a traditional dungeon and dragons and stuff I need to identify stuff before I wear it otherwise I might get cursed ie the one ring to rule them all type stuff so again that's where of course D&D &D started was with the uh, Tolkien stories do I have to go all the way around for that actually there's one way to tell yep it looks like it okay There doesn't seem to be a lot of mobs on this level, except for that spider there. Can I just hold the button? I can't hold the button. Okay, I don't have to be uh, spamming the button like normal. I could actually just hold it to move. I see. And again, if you want to move faster, you can use the um, sprint feature. But I'm a sexy barbarian woman with my axe. I don't need no man. Conan O'Brien fears me. Yeah, it's actually supposed to be Conan the Barbarian. But who cares? Names doesn't matter. Anyways. Let's, let's leave. Actually, let's fight this bastard. Bash attack. He has armor. That's why I'm not doing much damage. I have to go through his armor first, huh? He changes positions. I'm no longer fighting him, which is kind of shenanigans. Okay, hold on. All right, there we go. Attack that direction. Stone attack. Can't I dual wield? He's doing actual damage to me, by the way. Look at that. Five, four. This doesn't improve much. All right, let's uh, get out of here. There we go. Oh, cow. So that's a scorpion over there. That's a giant spider over there. I can just sit here and heal for a little bit. And they did eight damage. Move. Move, move, move. <laughs> okay, here we go. So let's see if I can heal. By the way, do I have anything to actually heal me in my inventory? That heals me for what? I have 10 now, 3 each. That's not a whole lot. But then again, you're not supposed to get your ass beat like I did. So, oh well. You know what? Let's just go out in a blaze of glory. I want to see if I could dual wield.
See if I get who dies first, me or him. One more hit. Oh, look at that. Last second heroics. Let's see what he dropped. Wow, look at all the stuff he dropped. That's all just kind of his skin. I could skin him. Pick up all. Oh, I actually don't have enough inventory space for everything. Oh, well, you know what? I'm going to call it there. I just noticed there's a quit button right here. So, yeah. Interesting game. Again, it takes a bit getting used to, but it's that traditional kind of move, single move dungeon crawler. Oof. Oof, excuse me. That's a dinner and whiskey. Mm. Trying to get their revenge on me. So, again, it's it's a massively multiplayer online playing game set in a... Ma oh, apparently this is a massively multiplayer game. I didn't see anyone else, but then again, it's, you know, about midnight here. So, everywhere else is about sleep now, so... Is it cross-platform, I wonder? Anyways, so if you could actually play with other people, that'd be fun. Huh. Endless hours. So that adds a whole nother la layer to that, I guess, where you could actually fight with other people. So, me and three others can actually take that guy down a lot faster but again it takes some getting used to with the controls so that was my major downfall there otherwise very interesting little dungeon crawler again I didn't know it was online multiplayer I guess that's why you need to log in but anyways so yeah there's a quick look at the game thanks again for watching and see you next time